Good morning, Titans, and welcome to TNN. Today we will be looking at electives, sports, and roses, so stay tuned. Hey, teachers. We know you use many, many batteries. They die, they break, they fail. And disposing of them properly is a pain. Inside the teacher's mailroom, there is a white bucket with a blue top specifically for batteries. If you have batteries at home or at school that simply don't function, feel free to take them to the mailroom. We'll take them to a recycling center from there. Thank goodness I saw that video. I really don't know what to do with batteries normally. Yeah, make sure you recycle your batteries. Keep the environment clean. <laughs> okay, well, I'm Catherine. I'm Lexi. And I'm Olivia. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. Freshmen, sophomores, and juniors, are you looking for your electives? Here's some videos about, here's some, here's a video for more information. All 9th, 10th, and 11th grade students, you will have two weeks, February 4th through the 15th, to select the elective classes you want to take next year. All electives must be entered through the ARIES parent portal. If you don't go in and add the electives you want, you could miss out on those classes. We will be holding an elective fair in the main quad during lunch on Wednesday, February 6th, so you can get all your questions answered directly from the teachers. If you have any questions, contact your academic advisor. Make sure to choose your electives right away. The fair is today at lunch. Here's a video about TNN. Good morning, Tesoro. I'm here vlogging in the TNN okay, studio. Okay, I think we've all seen that video enough times. Anyways, TNN is a super fun class, so make sure to sign up. Another fun class is digital photo. Let's see the video. Hey, Titans. Are you struggling to find an elected to take next year? If you are, you should consider taking digital photography. Digital photo is a class that teaches the physics of how a camera works, how to use proper exposure, and some basics of Photoshop. Not only does it give you the opportunity to learn how to take amazing photos, but it also helps by giving you college credit and a grade bump. If you're still a little hesitant about joining, come by room 913 and talk to Mr. Hallam. Best teacher ever. If you have any more questions. I'm Samantha, reporting for TNN. Like they said, if you have any questions about photo, go talk to Mr. Hallam or my good friend Robert Engar for more. Finally, Hallam's final class, video production. Do you want to make videos but not have it broadcasted to the entire school? Then video production might be right up your alley. Video production is an amazing class for whether you want to learn the basics of filmmaking with professional technology or just to make entertaining videos with your classmates. In the class, you will learn how to use a DSLR camera, sound equipment, and how to edit. For each video project, you will incorporate different filming techniques, storytelling styles, and different assignments will usually take two to three weeks to fully produce. I know that we had a great time in the class last year, but let's go ask some of the current students what they think of it. So what was your favorite part about the class? Uh, I just really like learning about film, and film's been a huge inspiration to me, and it's just really cool learning all the different things that go into it to make a movie. Probably just all the uh, expert tools and tricks he, that the teacher taught us, everything that's kind of helped me into TNN, too. So what's your favorite video you've made so far? Uh, so far, probably my favorite video I've made is probably my music video because we actually remade a part of Bohemian Rhapsody, the music video, and it was pretty fun to make and just try to uh, recreate what they did in the in that music video. So, I would say the uh, interview we made with Hallam, that we just interviewed him on what it's like to be a teacher. I make a difference, not just in their lives, but in the lives of all. My favorite video was the sci-fi video because we got to learn how to shoot lasers and explode and it just made our videos ten times funnier. Probably the zombie movie that we made in the beginning of the year. It was one of my favorites because it turned out the best. So. And if you still aren't convinced about taking video production, just remember you do get a grade bump for this class. From the TNN seats, I'm Cole. And I'm Jordan. Reporting for TNN. Well, I loved Cole's zombie makeup, and I really wish I took that class. It looks like a lot of fun. By the way, guys, all of Hallam's classes are five points, and you can earn college credit. Well, that's definitely enough from Mr. Hallam. Let's see what Lexi has to say about the other classes. <laughs> I'm going to do. Thanks, Scott. 
Another great elective is ceramics. Miss Evans is a great teacher who teaches you the skills to make amazing clay projects and let you use your creativity. Another great class is publications, aka yearbook. If you're interested in photography or journalism, this is the class for you. You don't need any past experience to join, so if you want an application, go to room 919. Students, the spring CSF membership drive will take place February 4th through the 22nd. All sophomores, juniors, and seniors are encouraged to apply. Applications will be available starting February 4th outside of room 1113. If you have any questions, see Mr. Soma in room 1113. Do you have a special someone? NHS is having a rose sale outside the ASB office at lunch. Roses are $3 for one and $5 for two. Roses will be delivered on Valentine's Day. If you're interested in AP Computer Science, here's a video about the class. It's pretty amazing when you start building something that you want, it can help change a lot of people's lives as well. And having even a little bit of grounding in computer science can help you think about the world differently, whether that's algorithms or whether that's just creativity. Computer science principles covers lots of topics, not just programming and coding. We cover bits and binary, we cover how the internet works, how security works, how data is collected and, and used and shared. And all of these things help you get a better understanding of how the world works. In the new economy, computer science isn't an optional skill, it's a basic skill. Be able to code gives you the freedom to build anything. And that is just so empowering. If you're interested in designing things, creating things, solving problems, then this class is for you. If I was interested in computers, I would definitely take that class. Yeah, I know my friend Jackson loves that class. Yeah, that class looks super interesting. Wish I took it. Well, that's all I have for my portion of current events. Now over to Rice with sports. Thanks, Lexi. Baseball has a game on Thursday, February 14th at 3 against Chino Hills at home. Good luck, boys. Boys basketball has their first CIF game on Tuesday, February 12th at 7 at home against a team that will be announced. <laughs> boys wrestling is working very hard for CIF. Keep it up, boys. Girls and boys track team just had their first meet last weekend. It went really well, even with the bad weather conditions. And they'll be racing more at the end of February. Keep it up, guys. Girls lacrosse has been practicing hard the past couple weeks for their game at the end of February 28th at SM. They have been doing seven versus seven in offense and defense drills to prepare to destroy SM's team. Well, that's all I have for my sports. Now over to Kat to finish off the show. <laughs> well, that's all we have for today, Tesoro. Thanks for tuning in to your one and only source of Titan News. Have a Woodward Wednesday. <laughs> Thanks for watching TNN. It's your favorite source of Titan News. That's it, guys. Love ya. It's Raniel. Bye.